Team members with the Salvation Army in Reading are seeking community support for their food pantry. The North State's News' Devin Horinda spoke with a volunteer as well as a staff member from the nonprofit about the food services they offer. She joins us live from the location on Lixper Lane in Reading. Devin, what are they saying about food insecurity in the area? Ariana, the people with the Salvation Army I spoke to say the need for food donations is great and they're seeing a growing number of people showing up to their pantry. The Salvation Army staff in Reading serves food to the community on Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays from 10 in the morning until noon. Community members who apply can come in once a week for fresh food, plus once a month for a non-perishable box of food. Salvation Army Social Service Coordinator April Hughes tells me some groceries come from partnerships, plus donors give non-perishables. Both she and volunteer Roger Plato say they've noticed more and more locals stop by the pantry in recent months. I see those lines from September until now increase oh, because there's more people living in the home and, and food costs have gone up. So it is very, very important that we get these donations so that we can help serve our community. It's just a wonderful thing and, and heartwarming for me and other people to give to those that do not have what they need. Hughes tells me on average there are upwards of 240 people a week going to the pantry for food services. Just last week, she says their team got a lower amount of food from grocery stores and some community members were turned away as a result. Coming up on May 9th, North State donors can bring non-perishable food items to the Stuff the Bus food drive benefiting the Salvation Army. That'll be at the Golden Valley Bank locations in Chico and Reading from 6 in the morning until 6 at night. Hugh says in addition to food drives, people can show their support by donating non-perishable food items at their location anytime during the work week. Live in Reading, Devin Renda, The North State's News.